Hi everybody, we're here at the beautiful coast on Tofino. Check it out. Today's a bit of a foggy day, but we've had some really nice weather till now. Where we're looking at our research group at the Orca Sea Stars. Uh, they're actually quite uh, uh, prevalent over here among these rocks. See, this is like a perfect habitat because as the tide uh, is low right now, it's about 10 uh, 30 ish in the morning. The tide's pretty low right now, so if we go into the crowd into the rock cracks like yeah we'll, we'll see some starfish and hopefully we'll be able to see some with wasting disease come on over. <laughs> so we're here right now at Mackenzie beach which is our site too um and uh if you look over here it's just a perfect habitat to find your sea stars and if you look right in the crevice here of the rocks you can see they're in a cluster um we sometimes see stars uh kind of by themselves but we also have seen a lot of these stars kind of clustering together like this so if we use a ruler and if you look at the um, the millimeter scale we can we can measure the uh, the arm length so you kind of want to measure from the rate the radius uh, sorry you kind of want to measure from one of the straighters arms down to the, um, the the central disc here so this guy would be about 80 to 90 uh, millimeters as you can see there um, also here this is the purple star uh, they, they does come in a couple of colors so the, like this will be more orange there's also there's also some that are brown purple uh, these are the most all right so here we have a perfect specimen of a very healthy uh, sea star this is uh, on the top layer we see um, it has rough uh, edge uh, ridges and over here would be the um, anus. If you turn it onto the oral side, you can see the two feet. These are the feet it uses to climb against the rock surface. It can even be found on these um, uh, surfaces with, with barnacles. You can see the radial symmetry, the arms. These arms, actually, if you cut them off, they will regenerate. Um, this one's a pretty healthy one, so we give it a zero from the scale that uh, Aaron and Holly talked about. Over here, if you look closely, this star has a denzovirus. It's affected, and how you can tell is this white inflammation along the sides uh, of its arms, all the way into um, the into the body region over there. And you can see it's barely it's barely hanging on. Um, it's it's um, it's essentially wasting away. Um, yeah, you can stop now. 